Welcome back to you all. Our topic today is insects that harm us. Today we are going to learn about insects that harm us, hear about some insects that are hunters and farmers, answer questions about insects. Activity 1. Insects that harm us. You might have heard the phrase, sleep tight, don't let the bed bug, bugs bite. Perhaps this phrase, bugs you, or other things might be bugging you. These are just a few of the common expressions that reflect how much bugs or insects are disliked. Insects do bug us by spreading disease, eating our homes or our food, or hurting us with stings and bites. Why do insects bug you? Write your answer in your diary or in a notebook. Insects carry diseases. Some types of mosquitoes carry illnesses such as malaria. Malaria is a sickness that kills millions of people each year. Flies and cockroaches carry germs that can cause a runny tummy. There are insects that bite or sting people, like wasps, bees, fleas, mosquitoes, and horseflies. Insects can be pests. Plant lice and locusts can destroy food crops. Locusts are grasshoppers that swarm. Some types of small beetles eat dried goods such as rice and flour. These beetles are called weevils. They are pests in the kitchen. Ants can also be a real nuisance in the kitchen as they have a knack of always finding the sugar and sweet food dishes. Insects are hunters and farmers. Ants milk the plant louse for honeydew, just like a farmer. A butterfly sucks nectar from a flower. Praying mantises are good hunters. They sit and wait to catch insects. Activity 3. Question time. Answer these questions about insects. Number 1. Name the insects that can bite or sting us. Well done! Wasps, bees, fleas, mosquitoes and horseflies can bite and sting us. Number 2. Which insects can cause a runny tummy? Mmm, you can do it. Come on boys and girls, yes. Flies and cockroaches carry germs that can cause a runny tummy. Well done. Question number three. Which insect can give us malaria? Come on boys and girls, you should know the answers. Which insects can give us malaria? Yes, some types of mosquitoes carry illnesses such as malaria. Question four. A big group of locusts are called? You know it, boys and girls. A big group of locusts are called a swarm. Boys and girls, not all insects bug us. There are a lot of insects that help us. Think of all the insects that do help us. Write down as many reasons as possible why we need insects. You did a good job, boys and girls. Thumbs up. And we'll see you next time. Bye.